Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, today, why do I have to say um at the beginning of every video? <sighs> Anyways, so welcome back to my channel. Hope you guys are all well. <clears throat> um, I want to say hi to all my new subscribers. I don't have that many, but you guys are very appreciated. Um, today, I'm just going to do a haul video slash like I don't know maybe like a help you out kind of video um, because I recently signed up for makeup class to get um, like a professional makeup class to get certified as a makeup artist and so that's what this haul is going to be on the stuff that I got for my kit to start my kit and whatever I still have a good amount of things to buy but I'm not going to buy them just yet, just because um, I'm like I'm the only person in my class because where I'm going, they kind of want it to be more hands-on, so <clears throat> they don't do, there isn't that many people in the class. It might be because it's so expensive as well, I don't know, but um, it's close to my house and I like the area that it's in and I like the actual... I like the inside where the class is and everything. It's set up really nice. And they it's actually a makeup store and they also the where the classes are at, the makeup store does the makeup classes and certification and whatever. So this is the list I got. Long list. <laughs> but um yeah, I didn't buy everything on here just because you bring your own models so i'll be bringing people that i'm familiar with and people that are like my family members and stuff like that so they won't mind like me using the things that i have already like i have you guys know i have a ton of lipsticks i have like 50 lipsticks probably maybe more and like i have tons of eyeshadow you guys know so I wouldn't, I didn't want to like go out and spend on that just yet when I don't absolutely need to. <clears throat> so I'm just going to show you guys the things that I did get from that list. So the rest of the things from the list I will be putting from my, what my collection that I already had. Um, so the first things on the list are foundations and powders and that is the thing that I knew I would have to spend money on because obviously I have foundations for my skin tone and I have foundations for lighter than my skin tone because I used to be much lighter um, so I just put these in here for now it's just a little Hello Kitty quilted type of bag but I do like it because it's very deep and quite wide and big so I just put those all in there now the brand I did get was I got Iman it's called and I did get this one because it's the cheaper of the professional makeup that they had at the store um, now I will be adding MAC foundations to my kit for uh, like all these skin tones but when I will do that when I get back to Canada because obviously a foundation in a MAC foundation in Jamaica is like four or five thousand dollars or more and if I were to get eight different skin tones that would just be ridiculous amounts of money that I, I don't need to spend right now so but I do like these these are really creamy <clears throat> and I didn't get every single skin tone obviously like I said I'm just starting my kit um, so this is what I got I got uh, sand light medium um, these are the pressed powders so that looks like that it's for a lighter skin tone obviously I got um, clay medium dark <coughs> sorry clay medium dark um, I got clay 2 that looks like that. Sorry if I haven't been showing. I got Earth 2. Probably can't even see that, so it's probably kind of pointless. 
um, Earth 3. That's the darkest shade I got. So, whatever colors I did not buy, um, why I didn't buy them is because I can easily just take some out with a spatula. Now, these are the cream foundations, and these are the exact same shades, all of these, as the powder foundations. So, whatever color I do not have, I can easily mix. Now, I know instead of buying each of these things separately, I could have just bought a palette, but I start class on Monday, so, uh, and today is, what, Friday? I think it's Friday. <laughs> it's Thursday, so I don't have a lot of time to wait trying to find a palette here, and they aren't that easy to get access to um, for a good price. Because, you know, Coastal Sands palettes aren't that expensive and like BH Cosmetics and whatever. But seeing that it's Jamaica, people do hike up the price very high. Like they will charge you five, six thousand dollars for one palette. And it does it. No, not doing that when it's not that expensive. So I just got these and I just got this brand because it will be good to later have in my kit when I am like doing gigs and stuff like that so that's the foundations um, <clears throat> then I got this oil free moisturizer now I do have the Clinique dramatically different for dry skins to put to my kit um, the lotion and so I had to get one for oily skin so I got this oil free <clears throat> um, Neutrogena one and it has SPF 15 which I do like and it's a non greasy formula it says which it really is. It is not greasy, so I really like that. So I just wanted to have one for early skin. As you guys know, I have dry skin. So I had nothing in my kit that would be suited to dry skin. Um, so the other things I got, they're kind of boring. You needed to have Bouncy, the white one, so because this doesn't have any ink in there. Um... Let me just put these back. It's taking up so much space. Um, so yeah, I got the bouncy. I got cotton balls. <coughs> hair clips to put the client's hair back. Uh, I got eyebrow razors. Um, I got this spatula. I'm not quite sure what brand it is, but it's okay. It's just a spatula. And um, I got a cape. Which I probably shouldn't have bought at the makeup store because that was about 3000 and I could have gotten it just out of beauty supply for like a few hundred bucks, like 500 bucks or something. I got cotton swabs. Now I have the makeup cotton swabs with the flat end and the pointed end. But I want those for my personal use, and I didn't bring any more to Jamaica, so, um, yeah. I got wipes. Um, I got wedges. Because we don't, we won't be doing foundation with brushes, we'll be doing them with wedges. And I got a scrapbook. So that's just to put my pictures in when I do makeup looks and so forth. So let me just put these back in here really quickly. We don't need anything. Um, what else did I get? I got, now I have to go get some stuff. So, what I will be using, like, since I don't have a train came yet, case yet, I'll be using, like, these type of access bags, just one from Lancome. And then it came with these two smaller bags so I'll be using like bags like that and like um these bigger bags and stuff like that until I get a train case I got this Iman blush in blush duo posh and I just got this to have for darker skin tones because as you guys know my blushes are suited for my skin tone. And I, I got these two Iman lipsticks. I really don't like them. 
But I asked her to get me something for darker skin tones. As I do wear a lot of brights. So this first one, it's a brownie copper color. And I believe it's called, oh, it's iced tea. Really don't like this color, but um, whatever. I might ask her if I can exchange them. Since I don't like them. <laughs> but I don't know if I can do that, so. Um... The next one is Scorpion. This one is okay, but I still don't really like it. It's more of a reddy, coppery color. I won't swatch them, just because I do want to try, attempt to return them. So I won't swatch them just yet. If I don't get to return them, I will swatch them for you guys. Um, what else did I get? Hold on, just one second. Okay, last two things, or three things. I got this lip gloss, and I just thought this would be really nice because I don't have a matte, really pigmented red lip gloss. So that's what that looks like. It's, it's really pigmented. It's not going to come up as pigmented as it is. Let me try and pack it on here. But it comes out exactly like it does in the tube. Very pigmented and creamy. No shimmer at all. Um, this is from Jordana and it smells so good. This color is called XOXO. I got a lip liner. You guys know I have tons of lip liner but I just wanted a really dark brown for darker skin tones. So that's what that looks like. And the last thing I got was this Milani Glitzy Glamour Gloss. Um, this is in the color 02, and I absolutely love this. I think I might try to find some more of these. It has no shimmer, it's just a creamy, um, mauve pink. It is gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. I'm in love with this. So, once again, the color on that is 02. I know it's backwards, but yeah, that's that's what I gotten I've gotten so far, and yeah. So over time, I'll be building up my kit and getting anything that I need that I don't haven't already gotten. Like it'll be mostly um, foundations and skin products to suit other skin tones, cause yeah, obviously I have the eyeshadows and the whatever. But yeah, I am, I am getting another palette because I left all three of my palettes. I left my 120, I left my 88, um, my other 88. I left all my palettes in Canada because I had no idea I was going to do this, um, this course. So yeah, it kind of just happened. But it's okay, I'll, I'm getting a new one. Um, hopefully it's not the same edition, it's from BH Cosmetics, but hopefully it's not the same edition that I already have in Canada. If not, then so be it. <laughs> I really need it right now. Um, if you guys are wondering what's on my lips, it's Viva Glam Gaga 2. It looks like this. Um, I'll swatch it here. So that's it there. I can get some light. It's a really nude color, as you can see. So there it is. And in the middle of my lips, I have the Glitzy Gloss by Milani in the middle of my lips. So they complement each other very well. 
And that's all guys. So all this video is a lot shorter than I thought seeing that my favorites videos and all that stuff in my hauls are usually like 20 minutes long. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this and I'll keep you guys updated on um, how my course is going and all that stuff when I get started and I'll show you guys pictures from my looks and maybe I'll record, have someone come with me to class so they can record and so I can upload it to YouTube for you guys to see. So until next time, hope you guys are all well and 